Hello, this is Jeff Walker with in -Depth Studies. Today we are in the book of Colossians, Paul's letter to the church at Colossae, and we are in chapter 1, verses 21 through 23. Here Paul says, Once you were alienated from God and were enemies in your minds because of your evil behavior, but now he has rescued, he or he has reconciled you by Christ's physical body through death, to present you wholly in his sight, without blemish and free from accusation, if you continue in your faith established and firm and do not move from the hope held out in the gospel. This is the gospel that you heard and that has been proclaimed to every creature under heaven, of which I, Paul, have become a servant. Now, this passage contains a number of things. We can't cover everything, but what I want to just to sort of remind you is that we were, as result of Adam's sin, we were God's enemies. We were God's haters. And we, we didn't want to submit to him. We weren't able to, but we didn't want to. But he has reconciled us through the cross. They say Christ's physical body through death. Well, that's the cross. And he says this is what purchase us, purchases for us unconditional acceptance. But... It says, if you continue in your faith, you have this. This is the issue of perseverance of the saints. That is, the evidence that Jesus died for you will be that you will keep on believing him to the end. You'll keep on living for him to the end. You will persevere in your faith to the end because God has promised to preserve you. This is part of what Jesus purchased for you on the cross. So if you don't persevere, it means Jesus did not die for you. If this has been helpful, check out more of Jeff's thoughts on youtube.com and there you can subscribe to them. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.